going on guys? We are here at Providence High School with Eli. Chairs in back. That was a hard one, I couldn't do it. But we're here to play between the bases and let's get started, you ready? Yes ma'am. So, what is the hardest part about being a student athlete? Uh, I would probably say maintaining time. The time management? Work. Time management, yeah. Providence is known to be a pretty hard school. Mm -hmm. What's your hardest class? Uh, probably say uh, history. All right, yeah. who's your teacher? Uh, Miss Pizarro. All right, new one. I'm a little bit older than that, I guess. Scary lady. <laughs> well, you're already committed. You're a sophomore. Mm -hmm. Where are you going? Uh, University of South Carolina. That's awesome. Not too far, mm -mm. but out of Charlotte at least. Yeah, at least, at least it's out of North Carolina. So we were just talking before and you said you already have senioritis and you're a sophomore. Mm -hmm. Are you keeping your grades up? Yeah, I'm keeping the grades up. Okay. Grades are staying up. Coach Hignite enforces that, yeah? Mm -hmm, All right, does. so that's good. So senioritis, but you're keeping it in check. Mm -hmm. All right, made it to first, and what we like to do with a lot of players is do 30 seconds of a ton of questions, and you just answer as many as you can. You ready? Right. What's your favorite class? Uh, History. Just, it's your hardest class. How is that so your good. favorite? All right, well, that's good. You like a challenge. Describe Coach Hignite in one word. Uh, unexpectable. That's a great one. Best part about high school? Uh, baseball. Okay. If you could live in a different time period, what time period would you pick? Uh, 1800s. Okay, that's good. Do you think that the new Xbox 5 will be better for gaming or the new PS5? Xbox 5. Yeah? So what do you think the hardest part of this upcoming transition to college will be? Uh, kind of basically, I guess, time management, like also with school. So I guess, yeah, just figuring out what to do. What made you pick that school? Uh, it's kind of just a place I went to because I went to many schools and it just felt like home, kind of. What made you jump out and pick so early though? You're only a sophomore. I realized Something I had stand out. I realized I had the options, so I was like, I was like, why not just do it now? Because I had it, I could have went anywhere, so I was like, might as well just decide now. What was your second option? Uh, Vanderbilt. Wow, that would have been tough, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm not that old, I swear, I'm only 24, but I am a couple years removed from high school. I have a song that I listened to while a senior drove me to school on my first day of freshman year and I thought it was so cool. So I'm gonna play it and see if you know the song and who the artist is, okay? You ready for this? Mm -hmm. All right. Did you cheat? No, I know. I okay. Oh my God. Mrs. Steer, Mr. Steer girl. No. I don't know the name. Give you one more guess. Way to take, way to take it literally and just take the lyrics. Here we go. I have bottoms up. I don't know. All right. It, so I am old. It's official. Even I know the song. Nicki I don't Minaj know the was in it too. I'm not good like, with names of songs. Okay. All right. Fair. But you knew the song. I did know. All right. Yeah. So I'm not that old. What that's, was it? That's the conclusion. You haven't told us. Bottoms up. Bye. By Trey Song. That's the last I'm thing. Right? Hunter was giving me the sign. I was trying to get it. <laughs> All right. I'm not that old then. That's good. All right. So going to school. What's your style outside of your baseball uniform? Basically anything designer or vintage. Okay. Gotta be rocking that drip every now and then. All right, tell me about these shoes, because these are pretty cool. Yeah, I was, I was, I was on Nike.com, saw the mismatched colorway, so I said, why not? With the hearts and the sun, too, yeah. huh? Anything mm -hmm. behind that, or just, nah, you just like just it? Nah, just there, yeah. What's your favorite designer? I'd probably say some Ovo. Ovo's kind of nice. I don't even know what that is. Do you know what Some that Drake is? stuff. Drake? Yeah. Okay. Is that your favorite artist too? No. no. Favorite no. artist probably would be probably Gunna, Little Baby. I know nah, Little Baby, thug. but I don't... Young Thug probably, yeah. I'm so out of the loop, Ryan. I'm only 24. <laughs> All right, so as we realized, I'm far removed because I don't know any of your artists or your style <laughs> or your, you know, designers, but Teach me some lingo that all the high school kids are saying that I want to know. Uh, you could probably say that's fi, like F Y E. Instead of fire. Yeah, and then you could say that's drip, or like. Same thing though. Is pass that, that John. What's that? It's like if someone's got something else in their hand, you'd be like, pass that John. No way. Yeah. Do we know the origin of that? No. A rapper or anything? Uh, no. Wow. It's kind of just there. Okay. Anything else? No. Okay. Well, I understood the fire part. <laughs> it was just shortened. If you entered a talent show at school, besides baseball, what would you do? Probably go up there and show some dancing. Nice yeah, dance let's food. see. Right uh, here. Throw it up. You catch that. Okay. Yeah. Is that a common one or is yeah. that your own little swag? That's thing? a pretty common one. Okay. Anything else you got for me? Nah. So nah. you're going to go up there and just do one dance? I mean, yeah, there's some other stuff, but. All right. 
Ain't Save got the music. Yeah. <laughs> okay, if you could be really good at one thing besides baseball, what would it be? Uh, math. I'm pretty suck at that. Really? Yeah. What would you do with it? Would you be a mathematician? No, nah, I would definitely not do math, to be honest, because you're not doing anything with math. I'd be a snowboarder. Okay, there yeah. you go. All right, we are going to let our audience rate your best bat flip. Are you ready to show us what you have? Sure, I got you. Let's see it. I'm going to walk away for this one. Being a nice swing. Oh, I hit that bomb. I just throw it. I just want it. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on Behind the Lights. We had a lot of fun today. And for friends and followers that want to keep up with you, where can they find you? You can find me on Instagram at 5jersey. All right, and continue to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Thank you. Give us a swing. Oh, yeah. <laughs>